All right. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another round of coffee and questions. And what's today's topic going to be? Talk about saving you some money. Now, if you don't have something like this, this is a toilet auger that I've had this uh, auger and it has saved me money. That's the key. If you don't have something like this, just as part of your home garage kind of tools and maintenance, you should consider getting it, especially right now. You're getting 14% off. The price has dropped from $40.99 down to $35.20. Ships Prime, all that other good stuff. And this is a very handy tool to have when you consider what a plumber or roto router service, I mean, would charge you. Um, I lent this to my neighbor the other day after he called. I believe it was one of these roto routering services. And they said, well, you know, the charge is we charge a service call in the first hour of labor. And so you're probably looking at anywhere from, you know, 80 close to $100, somewhere in there. And I thought, wow, you know. So anyway, he went over and in a matter of less than a couple of minutes by augering the toilet like you see here in the picture, it freed the clock. It saved him money. He was able to go on and do, I mean, other things with his money. So this is something you should seriously consider. If you don't have one, you might not need it right now, but the moment that you need it, you're gonna be glad that you have it out there, you know, in your garage, in the closet. Let me show you a couple other pictures and make a couple other comments, but this I think is a good bargain. And up here, Rigid was Amazon's choice. It's like I said, I happen to have gotten the Rigid. I got it out at Home Depot at the time, but I know that I paid probably a little bit more than the price you see right now for it. Um, but anyway, let's move on. Let me show you a picture, make a couple of comments. Okay, now this is similar to the one on the starting of the page that I showed you. I mean, if the toilet's plugged, it's probably going to be somewhere in the throat of this toilet, you know, coming down to where, you know, the flange is or in that curvature right there. So it goes down, you know, I mean, quite a ways in terms of unplugging it. And you simply advance it in like you see where the red part is here in the toilet. You have a hand crank up at top. You start cranking it and you just keep feeding it down. And what I generally do is I just feed it all the way down as far as it'll go. And I turn around, I keep cranking it, and you can just pull on it and it pulls back up. Take it out, I go out and I wash it off with a garden hose or something like that, let it dry out, I put it back in the closet. So, how much are you going to save? Well, that depends on how much your toilets plug up. And now there are other devices out there. You can use a plunger. I don't think it works as well. I'm glad that I have the auger. I mean, like I said, I think it's about the best device for unplugging a toilet. It will last you years and years and years. So it's a good deal. Let me go back. Let me show you the ad one more time. And you can always click the link below. I mean, to read about this more if it's something that you're considering. But I would tell you it's a good bargain at the current price. Now, there was one comment that I did respond to where a guy had this compression or this compressed air device where you wedge it in there real tight and you pull a trigger and it shoots like a lot of pressure through the pipe. Well, you don't want to do that on a toilet. I mean, I can tell you right now, what happens is you have a wax ring between the flange and the bottom of the toilet and you can easily blow that seal. Um, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't use any of the water pressure devices. I wouldn't use anything that's got pressure like that behind there because that there is just that wax seal between the bottom of the toilet and the flange. So, you know, I mean, I don't, the choice is yours. I think that this is the safest way to go and it's worked for me every time that I've used it. All right, folks, I hope you have a great day. I will see you again on the next video. Consider the bargain. Like I said, links below. Drop me a comment and I hope you click subscribe. Thanks a lot. See you soon. Bye bye.